What's up, everybody? I'm Bell. And I'm Mel. And today we're going to be doing Breaking Bad Season 3, Episode 7. If you guys are new here, consider subscribing. We upload Breaking Bad every day. We also have the early uncut access of all five seasons of Breaking Bad over on Patreon. The links to that be in the description below. With that being said, let's jump to episode. Let's go. The hell is this? Okay. Remember last episode, the Pollo guy said to get rid of Hank. Oh, this is probably a backstory. On the twins. On the twins, yeah. Yeah. Ah, so if this is a backstory on them, usually backstories mean one thing sometimes. What do you mean? That they, th these characters might end up dying soon. Ah, you are right about that. Yeah, sometimes. There's a trend. These back yeah, there's a trend with backstories. Mm -hmm. ay, ay, ay. So maybe the story is going to... Oh, that's the uncle. Yeah. You just realized that? Yeah, I just realized that. Yeah, this is probably Tuco, the twins, and well, the, we call them twins, but yeah. yeah it's crazy how. I think he's talking about the, yeah, Los Poyos guy. <clears throat> so they've been doing business together for years. Mm -hmm. mm. It's crazy how a shave can make you look so much younger. This yeah, dude he looks, looks so old, but like that shit. 15 shave, years younger. Yeah. Mm. Terrible. That's a beautiful backyard. Oh, Marco. Did we know the twins' names? I don't think so. He's in Dunkey's Island. Damn. He was trying to teach him a lesson, but that was harsh. That's why those mm. brothers ride or die for each other. Right. That's crazy. Damn, that's a pretty crazy lesson to teach a kid. Yeah, but... no, that's... Oof. Mm. I do not agree with that. It's crazy. Yes. Oh, you know what? I actually learned about this in the show that I watch. What? This saint. Right. Because um, oh, he's drunk. They have oh. Hank's picture now. So can you pause it real quick? I just want to share. I just want to share this with you. Yo, why this thing not pausing? What the I hell? Just... Okay. So there's a show that I watch, like the smuggling show mm. on Disney Plus, mm -hmm. and so. Um, like it's real life, you know, it's real life it's like smugglers and mm, stuff mm -hmm. and a lot of these drug dealers worship this saint and supposedly this saint is supposed to protect people from Protect people that are doing bad things like smuggling drugs and whatever. Mm. So this is like a, a real thing like um, So Catholics No, this is a different. This is like well isn't isn't our saints and Catholics? No, but oh, okay. this particular oh, that's, saint, is some, some different okay. But yeah, we, we're ignorant to it. So yeah, I don't really know okay. like the rules or. Oh yeah, I got you. I got you. But I got you. Yeah, it's real. Like these drug dealers actually worship a mm -hmm. specific saint to protect them because they know what they're doing is bad. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. That's very interesting. But um, all right, let's keep going. But what they have Hank now instead of Walt. So well, because of the conversation they had with, with the Poyo guy. guy. But the thing is, What's you know, backstories usually say that. The people that are getting a backstory are the ones that are going to die. So, you remember last time I was saying, I don't think Hank can die in this story because it will just backfire for Walt. I think the best way to move forward in this story is to have those brothers being written off. And I think that's what's probably going to end up happening. And maybe it's Hank that's going to end up doing it. Don't tell me Hank is going to be here because he was duped. I bet Hank is here. Hank, I knew it. Hank is just going to go and just talk to him. Yep. Uh-oh. Talk to my lawyer. Look at those eyes. Yo. Can you hear me? I got nothing to say. I told you. You can call my... Yo. Oh, Christ. You ain't my wife's name. How'd you do it? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Hank, you're going to end up killing him, man. He's going he's gonna to press charges. 
He's if I if I was Jesse, I would press I charges would and put Hank behind bars. And literally, that would probably not only probably save Hank from these brothers, maybe, but also keep Hank off their backs. Not only that, a this restraining is, you, order you too. You press charges. If I'm Jesse, I'm pressing charges now. I'm saying this guy came into my house and assaulted me. Yeah. Press charges, Jesse, now. But knowing Jesse, he's he's not he's not too bright, so it's probably not. Not happen. only that, but this is the father and oh, not wait. the father in law, is the that... brother in law. Oh, it is. Oh, they're gonna know. Hank called the cops on himself. Hank called the cops on himself. Ooh. Oh, he just called the ambulance. He didn't call. It. Oh, he's in trouble. He's in trouble. He is in trouble now. Maybe you want to talk to a lawyer. Mm, right. <laughs> you better get a lawyer, Hank, because this is going to get interesting. Oh, and he got soul on his side. Soul's going to flip this, man. He, yup, he's going he gonna to get all the evidence he needs. Yo, Adrian. Rocky called. He wants his face back. <laughs> Dang. Come on, I gotta cheer you up. You see that? That's your get out of jail free card. Yep. You understand? Get out of jail free card. Right? Yep. Just In literal terms. <laughs> this beating? Best thing for you. Yep. You're home free. No, Jesse I was getting right? whooped, man. Tuco whooped his butt. Right. Hank it's whooped like his butt. It's like the punching butt. bag. You're now officially the cute one of the group, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I'm gonna be there grabbing my share. Mm. We'll be scrubbing toilets in Tijuana or Kings and see me when he wakes up in the morning and when he crawls to sleep. Damn, Jesse. What's left of him after I shred his house down? He's gonna be haunting him for the rest of his life. Oh, That's what Jesse's saying. This crusty ass forever. <laughs> Until the day, what happens next? Mm. Hank, I mean, I Hank, Walt. Damn. What do you have to say about I that? I, I, I don't know what to say. I, I'm kind of speechless, too. <laughs> What's Saul's Probably advice? Not a good strategy. Wait, they're forced to hit that hard. Right. They will turn over every rock, hither, thither, and yon, and leave it behind, all of it. Thing changes mm. once I walk out of here. I have a get out of jail free card. Hey, I may have overstated the uh, power. This is not monopoly. Right. This is this is not. It doesn't actually work like that, yeah. Jesse. If the cops. No, your get out of jail free card is this. You need to move forward and just leave this behind. You keep going, they're gonna catch you. This ain't gonna hold. This ain't gonna have no power. Oh, he's going to sell out Walt? Heisenberg and his million dollar truck. What? Yo, Jesse, are you serious right now? You're my free pass. Oh. <laughs> Protect Jesse. No, but that, that because not only then, that, but Jesse's playing with fire. Look, if he didn't give up my name while Hank was beating him senseless, what will he do then? Believe me. He mm. should just start cooking with Walt in that Poyo Walt, spot. Walt would not have him in there. It's, I don't think so, but I'm saying like. The, the Poyo guy doesn't want Jesse part of his thing around. as well. You know what? The best thing for this story is for Jesse to go away too. There may come a time to talk options. Mm, that. Options. That would be wild. Yeah, because Jesse's the only way to get to Walt at this point. Nothing else. Because Walt is work the way Walt is, Walt is working right now, you can't and catch Skyler him. too. Well, Skylar too, but you know. I don't think she's gonna talk. Yeah, but Convince Walt is everything is so secure. It's like you can't catch him. Jesse's the only way to catch him. Simply what we're calling the blue mess. Track him to a scrapyard. Mr. Pinkman is pressing charges in this matter. He's given a detailed version of events as he sees them. Toxicology on Pinkman. Blood yeah, because he's been he's been. It is even refusing his doctor ordered pain meds, as far as we can tell. 
Mm. This is not looking good for Hank at all. Go from here. A couple of gentlemen from OPI will come down. Probably tomorrow morning. Mm. Flat on the table. It's fine. I'm actually very worried about Hank and his mental state. Not only his he mental already... state, his career is in jeopardy. His life is about to be in jeopardy. Sure, but oh, man, we Hank already is going... seen. Sheesh. This is getting well, crazy. Um, Hank, you know, going through PTSD. It's not, he doesn't not, have PTSD. Not, oh, not P, but, you know, he has like, um, anxiety. It's not really anxiety. He's um, trauma. No, no, what it's not. It it's not trauma. It's like he. the word is um, panic attacks. Okay, panic attacks. Yeah. So. He's already he's already unstable right now. So I think I hope this doesn't um Yeah, derail him. Yeah, I guess derail him would be the right word. Yeah. No, I y'all hear you for sure, but you know, we'll see how it plays out. Send him over the edge, that's what I was gonna say. Yeah. That makes sense. Hmm. I mean, I don't blame Hank for doing what he did to Jesse. And he doesn't even have his friends here, friend here anymore. Mm. Oh, this is gonna make me cry. Damn, man, this family was just, you know, they're just doing their thing. Everything's okay with the family. And Walt gets into this life and then <laughs> Everybody starts going downhill. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. Marie definitely going to be talking to her sister. Yeah, because she already told Skylar. Mm -hmm. He said Marie. Because like, yeah, he already, already know. know. He already <laughs> know like, what's who up, did, man. Who did He's he like, tell? <laughs> this girl, man. He knows she already his wife said something. So well. She's at um her man's house. Is that her man's at Hank's house? Oh no, that oh is... that is that is. Oh Walt's, no, wait. That's Walt's Oh, that's Walt's house. Yeah. That's all he's eating. You know, butter and jelly, jelly right. What the hell is Skylar doing here? I don't know, but I guess she never went to her boss's house. Like she never got out of the. No, but that, I'm saying, why is Skylar here at Walt's house? I don't Walt's know. House? I don't know. Remember, I think she's having sure, second of course, thoughts. of course, but still. She's like, wow, this Man. is nice. Hey, Walt, Walt, please, bro, just, you know, look, man, Walt. Hell mm. no. Uh, she's coming over here with that type of energy. Like, I don't blame you, but just don't bring, just don't do that. You heard about Hank? About what happened with Jesse? Remember what I said last episode, too? That if you see. Every, you see, everything I'm seeing is, is mm -hmm. happening. If something happens to Hank, you see how this is getting close? And she, she heard Jesse, she immediately tied Jesse to Walt. Yeah. You saw that? Yeah. So if something happens to Hank, Walt is in big trouble because Skylar is not going to stay quiet anymore, probably, because she knows that Hank, Walt is involved, involved some way, somehow. Yeah. So I think the best way for the story to move forward is for those two twins to go away. Some because if they go away, then Hank's life is okay and everything is good on that front. But then you have Jesse threatening Walt. That's another thing that that probably needs to go away. But Jesse's so there's a lot of things that need to go yeah, away. Yeah, but the thing is, the twins are new to this season. Yeah, Jesse has been around for multiple yeah. seasons, so it's gonna be harder to write Jesse off the story. So, and sure. I don't think you can write him off the story. He's so integral to the story. So, mm -hmm. I think that's probably where the downfall is gonna happen. And you could see the signs are there. Every time something bad happens between Walt and Jesse, it's always Jesse's fault. You yeah. Know, for the most part. Yeah. So maybe the way that these guys go down is is going to be Jesse at some point. Is this why you're here? She is worried about Walt. Can we talk about Hank? Hank could lose everything. Oh, so she's going to have Walt talk to Jesse. Mm. Maybe, maybe to drop the charges. Um, right. There's a way you can help him. Hank is your family. Hmm. Now it's like it's getting close. Mm. Like you said. He said not currently. Oh. I said not currently. Hmm.
Yeah, you go, Walt. But I get, like, he's currently not your family. I get sure. that. But, like... You've been married to Skylar. Like he has been your brother in law for so many years and all of a sudden you're like, I don't care about this guy. Right. And Hank has done for a lot for him too, you know? Exactly. Like, like they had a good Hank, relationship. Yeah, Hank, Hank cared for him. Even if like they're not technically family anymore, yeah. they can still be friends. I'm starting to get worried. Yeah, but I've seen you know my family, we got this kid and they've been divorced forever. <laughs> He's always at the parties too. <laughs> that is like true. what the heck? But that's what it is, that's man. True, that's that's true. you know when they're family. Just relationships yeah, when people. when you've been family forever, like they're these people are always gonna be family. Yeah, and blood always no, blood doesn't uh, always make you family. Families today. Let's get our trays ready. Clean. No I think I think no. Walt would mention something to Jesse though. I think he will. It's our uh, done. This dude Walt's gonna be like, yo, this guy's too good. It's not. This guy's not just an assistant. This guy's taking my job. He's trying for. <laughs> Yo, Walt is not feeling this dude. Keep it professional. That's all I'm going to say. Walt is not feeling this guy at all. Is that the twins? I think that is. <clears throat> so, uh, those are ugly suits. This guy's dead. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, this guy's 100% dead. Oh, this guy got weapons? Damn, they're going to war. What the heck? They got all kinds of stuff in here. Check it out. Uh, you like that? So sweet, you want to lick Probably it? Probably going to be like, we'll take everything. Casing, Lubelox, Code 4 Panache. Sucker has six razor claws that expand upon impact. <laughs> Shred your mama's head like a cabbage. Vest. Vest? The they said something. Vest. Right. Vest. I don't leave home without it. They got, they're about to shoot him right now. I want to see if it works. Damn, they're not going to kill him. They're just make, doing business. They were just testing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Damn, they actually broke his rib, though. Like, that's crazy. Now he got to drive back with a broken rib on a truck. Good luck. So that's all they came for? Yeah, was vests? Vest, yeah. Like, no weapons? They already got their weapons. That's how sure, they shot but them. like... Yeah. I mean, there was like new weapons. Gail, what temperature did you set here? Here? This is chemistry. Degrees matter. Damn. Sorry. I'm very sorry. Hmm. Is he th is he having second thoughts? Does he want Jesse on board instead of this guy? Hmm. Maybe this guy is too um too smart for him, and like you know they they don't he needs someone that you know that he can control. Compared, this hmm. guy doesn't seem easily controllable because he knows so much. Hmm. But Jesse would probably fit better with him, maybe. He's going to court. You look nice. New job. No, what is it? No, he's has a good new job. This what? No. I have to squeeze some orange juice. You want to grow some orange juice? Yes. It happens all the time. That would not hold in court. Everything that she said just didn't even make sense. The problem is, let me tell you what can what happens in gonna happen in court. Um if Hank decides to lie here, he definitely can win. But the problem is, is Hank going to lie? Because he can win. Because this is the problem. There's no witnesses. There hasn't been not one witness come forward saying that this is exactly how it played out. So it's his word against a DEA, DEA agent's agent. word. Mm -hmm. And guess who's going to win in the court of law? <laughs> the DEA agent is going to win. So if Hank decides to lie like Marie is telling him, 
you know, say that he swung first and he resisted arrest or whatever the case may be, you know, he could plead self-defense here. Maybe the TU showed up at Jesse's house to question him about certain things. And he was Jesse, trespassing. Sure, but. So Hank just being at Jesse's in Jesse's property? No, but he's he's a DA. He he can't he can't. He was inside Jesse's house. No, no, sure, but I'm saying it. They were at the door. They were questioning, and he could say that Jesse swung on him. Then he swung on Jesse, and then it became an altercation that way. There's ways. To, there's ways to sure, lie and but put this in what, your favor. But Mar- Marie, Mary is Marie. Marie. Marie was saying she like she brought up a pipe. There is no pipe in the. In that location. Yeah, there's no pipe on scene. There's, there's no there's pipe no on scene. Of a pipe. Sure. Um, Jesse was not armed because she said that Hank had to disarm Jesse. Jesse never had a weapon. Mm-hmm. So things that she brought up would not hold in court because there was no witnesses, but also there was there's no weapon. Sure. No. What, there's what, no pipe. There's no weapon she, with with um Jesse's fingerprints or anything. I'm not like saying that. everything she's saying is is could kid work um, a lot of things that she says are ridiculous the pipe that's ridiculous there's no what? those are ridiculous okay. points but i'm what i'm saying the idea <laughs> the idea that yes. hank can lie and win is a pos is a reality well he you can know what lie and win if he wanted to but he, he's not he, going he to. can lie but guess what there's proof where's what proof is what there? Pro- there's proof of hank being um of Hank mistreating Jesse. Look how Hank left Jesse. His face. That's enough evidence. There was not a scratch mm. on Hank. Right. If Jesse threw hands first, there would have been evidence. Right. Hank would have had a black eye. Jesse, his uh, knuckles would have been like messed up like Hank's was. All evidence points to Hank being the aggressor, not the other way around. That sounds great, but that's not how it and, works. But I'm saying you're saying his word against his, uh, uh, against Jesse's. Sure, but what's fact is Hank put his hands on Jesse, and there is proof of that. Yeah, that They're not going to use. Oh, oh uh-huh. okay, okay, that, okay, okay. okay. Not, how often do you see that? that, I, that I watch shows like this all the time. How often do you see that officers? People that work for the law enforcement and and federal agents or whatever went out on cases that they shouldn't win out because they're the ones they're the ones that are the federal officers here. You need you need so much proof to really put down a federal agent. It's not even funny. If Hanks des- if Hank decides to lie, first of all, Jesse is a known criminal. That is a fact. He is a no. Sure, but my response let to me that. Let talking. <laughs> but wait. But, but let me finish. But, but I want to respond to that but, point. But let respond. me finish talking. Okay. Jesse is a known criminal, right? Okay, yes, he is. Jesse's a known criminal. He's he's being investigated in this in this case, right? The case of Met or whatever. If he's a known criminal and there's there's evidence that could point to that he is a person that's doing illegal activities with the Met, who's to say that he didn't swing on Hank? They're already, he's already painted as the bad guy. Hank is. I'm, I Hank want to respond already, to that. Hank is the good guy trying to bust the bad guy, and the bad guy swung on Hank, and Hank fe- felt tw- threatened for his life, mm-hmm. and Hank defended himself mm-hmm. and ended up busting up Jesse. Okay, can I respond? It's that, to that? simple, but look, I'll, let okay. me respond to that, and we'll wrap right. it up. Right, right, right. My response to that mm. is that yes, Jesse does have a history of drug use, but. He had ever since he went to rehab, just like the detective said. Right there, I didn't, I didn't say drug. I'm saying criminal. Yes, criminal. He, he, sure. he does drugs as well, but he has a criminal record. Sure, he has a criminal record, but but as of the last few weeks, few months, whatever, he's been clean. Just like, and that's something that um, Jesse has on his side, is that he has been clean. He hasn't been in trouble. Actually, Jesse doesn't have a criminal record. I take that back. I think he he's been, um, he's been questioned by the law before, but I don't know if he exactly has been charged with anything. I don't know, but, before, I, but for he sure has he has questioned. a history, history of with, drug use. A history but, with the law. <laughs> but even the detective said, "Well, we we tested um, Jesse's like blood or whatever, and he sure. came out clean." 
Whatever. That, but that, what okay. does that have to do? Okay, okay, what, okay. Are, what does being clean have to do with Hank lying and and? Because it's his word versus the others. All right. At we'll the end of the day, there is no what? sound The comment evidence. section. You guys clear the air. That's it. I'm, let, let, sure, let's I get see you. what they say. I get you. But I'm saying, if why did you think Hank's lawyer, when they asked, when they when the when the other guys like oh so after the the you went to the yard and didn't find the RV it was that that was that the time that you went to go to Jesse Pinkman's house and what did the lawyer say? You need the day off. My client was going because the lawyer knows that whatever what comes out of Hank's mouth right there after that point is going to um um what's the word I'm looking for is going to um. What's the word I'm looking for? What lead him? No, that's 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 gonna indict. Sabotage? That's gonna indict. Th- those are indicting words. Whatever words comes next, they could indict him because he will. He's gonna be the one that personally says, "Yes, I'm the one that went to his house and basically." Well, um, he clearly went to his house. Sure, but that's why the lawyer's not because you can you can lie your way through certain scenarios. So that's what I'm saying here. There is no. Jesse has a side of the story and Hank has another side of the story. Guess who the law is going to side with? They're going to side with the DEA agent. They're not going to side with Jesse. Okay. So that's what I'm saying here. Okay. But Hank is not going to do that. Hank is going to probably be honest here. But, you know, I want to see what the comments think. Well, this this is why this is fun because um, the comments get to agree with you or get to agree with me. Or they don't agree with me. Well, neither one of us. <laughs> one yeah. of us. <laughs> There you go. Well, of course, anyone can lie. But I'm saying he's not going to... You know what's going to happen? Jesse's not going to show up in court. That's what's going to happen. Yeah, I think Wall's probably going to convince Jesse to drop the charges. That's probably what's going to happen. That's not what the job is. He feels guilty. Exactly. Because the job of... See, Hank is a... He's... You see? Okay, I'm gonna part, but Hank is an honorable... Honorable federal agent. Honorable, you know, cop, whatever. DA agent. DA agent. Because... He is literally telling you that's not what the job is about. And that's why a lot of people in that kind of world felt that they fell at this job. Like they think that because even in the, mili- above the law, even in the military, they tell us this. We're supposed to be the good guys. We're supposed to do it the right way. The the, the other guys are never going to fight fair because they're, they're already on that side. But we're supposed to fight fair mm-hmm. and we're supposed to catch them fairly. Obviously, it's a tough thing to do because I've been in that position before. And it's really it's really tough to, you know, to. To know, have someone, because like, let's say the rules of engagement, they have to shoot at you before you even start shooting at them. You know what I'm saying? And you, you know, they're, you know, they're the enemy, but do you, you, you just can't. So that's the same thing here. He over, Hank overstepped the rule of law. So, and as an honest agent, he's, he's not going to lie. Cause I, I could tell that Hank wants to be honest about his job, but some cops, some agents, people in that world, they don't care. They're going to. You, the enemy fights unfair. Guess what? They're gonna fight unfairly too, and that's just the way it works sometimes too. But there are few and far between these honest men that want to do it the right way. And Hank seems to be that guy, and I don't think he's gonna lie unless Jesse drops the charges. Yeah, he's been doing consumed. things against the he's law. He's been consumed by this. No, but he's been doing things against the law, like going to check out RVs. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's true. Yeah, the old, that's the all old illegal couple? stuff. Mm-hmm. I don't sleep at night anymore. The old couple. Mm. Just panic. Mm-hmm. I tried. I'm glad he's opening up. Hmm. You gonna retire? Mm. I think that's the right thing to do. <clears throat> and seek help. Get better. You see, at least Hank is honest with that. Cause some some cops don't do that, and they keep in that job. Like I mean, you, you see all these videos and like these these these, these officers, they just they panic. They panic in these situations, and they they you know. They let their fear control the situation over them. 
as a cop, you can't allow that to happen. Mm -hmm. You cannot, you cannot be in that job and allow that to happen. You have to take control of the situation. Always. There is no, there is no accidents in this kind of job. Imagine you a pilot saying, Oh, there's, I, I had an accident and, and, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. There's certain things in this world that these jobs that you do, we can't. You cannot allow your allow yourself to, to 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 be human. What well, we are human, but you cannot have. You cannot let these things come in because if they come in and these mistakes and these these situations happen and they overwhelm you, that it's not only your life at stake. Everybody else around that situation is at stake as well. Yeah. You're not. It's not only you. So, and I think Hank is making the right choice here. He understands that. He is not mentally capable of doing this job anymore, mm -hmm. and he has to step away. And some more people need to realize that too. And you know, we'll be better off that way too. But you know, it is what it is. This is, is not an easy decision, but it is one that I have to make. I'm sorry, it's just not working out. Hmm. He's gonna get Jesse back yes. in now. Is Jesse Pinkman? Is Jesse? Mm. You're right about that. Yep. He probably hung up. <laughs> he said, okay, "Are you crazy?" Thank you. Yes. See, Jesse's gonna I drop will. the charges now because now he's gonna be back in with Walt. They're gonna be together. Jesse will drop the charges on Hank. But there's another caveat. And then caveat. also, Jesse needs Walt now. Yeah, but there's another caveat. Something's come up. Those two twins. If yeah. Hank dies here. It's a good this is gonna blow the whole thing. There's been a job opening. No. Damn. That's some good makeup. Damn, Jesse said no to that. That is very interesting. You're turning down one and a half. I want nothing to do with you. Ever Damn. since I met you, everything dead. Ever since I hooked up with the great Heisenberg. How is Jesse putting I'm that on Walt? That's part of your fault. Probably a lot of the times, Jesse. No one. You have nothing. All right, Who did you have Heisenberg before Walt? Kind of, uh, Walt kind of like threatened him no. getting into this business. No, no. Man, time out. I don't agree with Jesse. He said that everything is gone now that Jesse. The only thing that's gone is that girl. And that girl's even remotely. That girl is a thing you could say because Walt came into his life. She probably would never have been a thing if Walt never came into his life. But he's saying he's lost everything. How has he lost everything? Everything that he's really had was because of Walt. Before that kind of operation, he, he almost got busted by Hank. And Walt saw him. Walt could have busted him and said, this guy was there too. Yeah. I What Jesse's saying here is completely ridiculous. Saying, oh, because of... No, you're the main reason that Walt and you always seem to not succeed in certain things. It was mainly always Jesse's fault. Yes, Walt was hard on him, which I think he was rightfully so to be hard on him. But what Jesse's saying here is ridiculous. Like, what did he really lose? Like, what did we know Jesse to have? He had a home with his parents, right? His parents came and took it. Guess what? He got the home back. Because partly because of what? The money he made with Walt. Like, I don't I don't know. I don't know what, what Jesse's saying here. Like, this is this sounds completely ridiculous. But it's just he's just going through the motions. Alright, it's all gone. Get it. All gone. No. What's all gone, Jesse? No, I don't get no. it. Why? Right? That is true. You don't give a shit. That is probably true too. You said I was no good. Yeah, he was just going through the motions. Fifty fifty. Oh, he agreed. <laughs> oh that he agreed. Of course he did. I used to have a phone like that. Me too. I I had that exact same phone. Please don't go back to drugs, Jesse. Please, please, oh, please, 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 please don't go back to drugs because this is the worst. 
this is this the is pain meds. Mm -hmm. Drop the charges. Drop the charges. Drop the charges. And Hank has to walk away as well. See, everybody in that room knows, which is just how, what I was just talking about. So, he doesn't have to be honest here. Like and they all know this in this room. Mm. That's the way it happened. Mm. The consequences. Oh, boy. The light of these facts. Well, that's it for Hank. I think this is good. I just wanted to tell you something. To be clear, you didn't hear from me. But I want you to get your hopes up. They dropped the charges. Is Pinkman is impressing charges. The guardian angel. Walt, <laughs> Walt is Hank's guardian angel. <laughs> <laughs> Heisenberg. Oh, wow. And this, then, gentlemen, then people, this, this, is, this is how, this is how it works. This is how it goes down. Like, literally, this is how it goes down. The funny thing is, is like, little do they know, they all need each other. But remember what I said about the, the brothers. If Hank dies here, oh, oh my no. gosh, Hank is going to die. <gasps> Hank is going to die. Hank oh is going to die. Oh my gosh, you might be right. Hank is going to die. Oh my gosh, Hank is going to die. Oh my gosh, he's going to die. Oh my god. The gosh. brothers are gonna they're in the car. The door's already unlocked. Maybe they're they're not gonna kill him right now. They're just gonna take him hostage or something. Maybe maybe they'll give us the next episode. Maybe they'll be saved. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my I don't gosh. even wanna look. Thing is he doesn't even have his weapon or anything to protect himself. Oh. And I'll get the gag, Jag off oh. voices. Move! Hello? Hank, please. Oh my god, Hank, just get out, get out, get out, get out. Come on, get Hank, out. come on, come on, Hank, come on, Hank. Oh my gosh, I can't. This is too much. This is too much. Please just freaking reverse the car. Hank, move! Oh my god. Hey, Go! Just do it. Just, just do it. Just do it. No, no, Hank. No, no, Hank. Hank, I move, can't. man. This move. is giving me, like, I can't. I'm Hank, why are you in the same spot? Move. Bro, Hank. Oh, they're right there. Bro, Hank. You got no gun, bro. I can't watch this. He's he's panicking. He's panicking. Just hit reverse, please. Reverse? You mean he needs to go forward? There's, there's a car in front of him. He needs to reverse and get out of the parking lot. Oh, my gosh. 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 Oh my gosh. This music, I can't. He's dead. He sees them. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. I'm, I'm just. He needs to move, man. I can't. This is like literally like, I, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, my. oh they're probably gonna get confused with him. He's not, also a bald guy. Yeah, but that's not him. They're behind him. Come on, Hank, kill these guys. Come on, Hank. Come on, Hank. Come on, Hank. Grab the gun, grab the gun. Oh my gosh. He's paralyzed. No, that guy's done for. Yeah, that guy's done for for now. Hank got him. Did not tell you, it was either Hank or these guys. Hank got, Hank's, Hank got them. Hank got them. I think Hank got them. I think Hank got them. Because Hank has the weapon. This is crazy. Well, this these, is these like one of the bullet, craziest. Bulletproof vests oh, too. Oh, true. Oh, my, I forgot about that. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I had to take off my headphones because this was just too much for my poor little heart. <gasps> oh! Yo, they just killed this guy? He got no more bullets. Come on, he's reloading. This is your chance. This is your chance. He's reloading. Do it. 
No, 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 no. Oh my, he just doesn't know. Oh my. Oh, oh. Damn, Hank is gonna die. Oh my gosh, no. No, 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 no. No. He wants him to. He says to suffer. Easy. To suffer. He wants him to suffer. If he shoots him now, he will get him out of his. Like... Oh, but Hank, there's still that bullet on the ground. Oh wait. Oh. He has something. Oh, wait, the axe. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. This is freaking. Oh my gosh. Please, 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 please. Damn, Hank. Oh, uh, this is you too know, much. Remember, like, this remember what I told much. you, man? Walt, oh, man. Count your days, Walt. This is where the story is going to change for you. Shoot him in the head. Oh! Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Bro, what an episode. <laughs> Yo, that this, was crazy. This was, I think this is probably one of the, I think the craziest episode we've seen this far. Wow. Wow. I'm shocked and speechless. I'm shocked too. I don't think Hank is going to die here. I think, he'll, I, don't I, think, think I think he'll survive. I think he'll survive. But wow. like you said, the twins had to be... Cut out from the story. It's crazy. I'd be caught. I'd be seeing these things coming. Hank was the one mm -hmm. to do that. I didn't think Hank. I didn't think Hank would be the one to yeah. to kill them off. But um, man, he really has a guardian angel. Yeah. I wonder who was on who called him though. Maybe warning a him. guy. It has I, to be because he's the I only think one. It was a, no, he's the only one that knew. So yeah. I'm pretty sure it was the Boyles guy too. Yeah, but um, guys, amazing episode. You know, we we spoke a lot this episode. So there's no reason you to spoke just, a lot. Yeah, I spoke a lot. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I speak a lot sometimes. But um, no, great episode, guys. But um, yeah, we'll we'll see what happens next episode. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this reaction. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Follow us on Instagram and on Twitter. Link will be in the description below. Definitely, guys. See you guys later. Peace out. Yo. Hey. Hello. The audio looks like it messed up a bit, so, um, did you touch the